Well hello everybody, this is Mr. Magnetoscope and uh, this video is going to be quite different from what I usually do. This video will be about this uh, mini food processor and uh, more precisely we're going to take a look at the inside of this to uh, see how it works and you must be wondering why the hell am I making a video on this and uh, why do I have this and uh, I'll explain. So basically I went to Value Village to look for VCRs like I always do and uh, I didn't find any VCRs but uh, I saw this there and uh, so I decided to buy it because it was, it was cheap and uh, so I can do some experiments like uh, putting some small objects in this and uh, see if they're gonna blend like uh, you know these uh, will it blend videos uh, that we have all seen and uh, those are very old on YouTube they were in the early days of YouTube that guy who puts uh, everything in a blender like uh, the very uh, the very first iPhone that he put in the blender like back then when it just came out you guys have probably seen these videos but uh, this is just a cheap mini blender and so I thought I will put some small objects in it and uh, I've already done it as you can see it's pretty uh, like the jar is pretty uh, scratched and worn out because I've already done an experiment with it so when I came home with this uh, I took the small the first object the first small object that I that I saw that I could put in this and uh, so I found a, a dead light bulb uh, so I put it in there and blended it and uh, it blended and uh, but uh, the, this blender isn't uh, really strong so uh, it broke so uh, the, the, the shaft like the plastic that holds the blade the, that part broke because uh, it's brittle and uh, the, the plastic is brittle and uh, it this isn't very strong and it's not uh, it's just not not powerful so it's not very so suitable for like uh, blending objects and uh, now uh, since it's bro like the this is broken but uh, the, the inside the mechanism like with the motor uh, this is still like the motor still runs so I, I still can show this and uh, I decided to show this on my main YouTube channel, Mr. Magnetoscope, instead of my second YouTube channel, Mr. Mario, because, uh, well, this is something mechanical. So if you like VCRs uh, with like uh, the mechanisms in there in them, uh, you might like this too because uh, this has mechanical parts in it too, and uh, we're going to see how it works. And uh, so when I put the light bulb in this, I filmed and I uploaded the, the video on my second channel, Mr. Mario. So uh, if you want to watch that video, I'll put the link in the description. And uh, so now we will open this. So it looks like there are four screws on the bottom side to open. And uh, so uh, just show you. Uh, so it was only four dollars at uh, Value Village, Village des Valeurs, French name of it. So uh, it was uh, cheap. So that's why I bought it. And it was worth it. Uh, the experiment was uh, fun to do, even though it broke it. So yeah, it has been glued, and uh, so that's why it's hard to uh, pull out. So because it's like a sticking, sticking to it because it like there's a huge amount of glue there. All right, so uh, here this is what broke. The other part is in there, so it has already been uh, glued. So. Uh, after it broke the first time, but uh, then I tried to blend something again and uh, it broke again, so I'm not going to use this anymore. So this is just a, a cheap unit and uh, it just has a push button like this to activate it. So you have to hold it to uh, uh, to make it run. And uh, so the button won't uh, go down if this isn't uh, placed there. So you have to do this, and now you can push it. I can remove. I can remove this. So uh, there were like screws that were like in these holes, and uh, I took one off. But uh, like uh, the other ones, I was unable because like uh, I don't have any screwdriver that like uh, goes the uh, like in deep in that hole, and. Uh, 
So when that happens, I, I use my trusty Dremel tool. So a Dremel tool is uh, something useful when you want to take apart things, uh, but not reassemble them like they were. As you can see, I cut through the entire uh, plastic casing to just uh, remove this. The screws are, are still there. I could uh, have cut it. I've uh, cut them with uh, uh, the, the Dremel tool. And uh, so this is the mechanism in this. And uh, so they are. It's a gear mechanism. So uh, this is not what I expected. I expected that uh, they were like they would like be a belt that goes from there to there. So I, ex I expected that uh, it will be a belt mechanism, but it's ac it's actually a gear mechanism. So this is pretty pretty cool. So this is pretty interesting. Now thanks to my Dremel tool, I can show you the motor here. So this is what a mini blender motor looks like. Pretty cool.